there have been a lot of concerns about uh, special education that have been raised recently. And all I can say is that you know we're working on it very hard. We've got the assistance of the U.S. Department of Education, the assistance of all of our partners throughout the Pacific to identify those areas where we can improve and then to take steps to make those improvements happen. As part of this commitment, the Guam Division of Special Education hosted a regional conference that brought together stakeholders from six Pacific Island entities, as well as experts from the U.S. mainland. U.S. DOE Office of Special Education Program Specialist Janine Norbert. We are here uh, providing technical assistance and support along with our national TA centers um, around developing the state a systemic improvement plan, which is a plan to improve results for students with disabilities. Co-director of the National Center for Systemic Improvement, Kristen Reedy, said the plan is a new requirement imposed on all states and territories. We've all been having turns speaking with the group and we have a number of other presenters who are here working with them this week. According to Guam Deputy Superintendent for the Division of Special Education, Yolanda Gabriel, facilitating the training here on island brought the information to a wider audience, not only in Guam, but in participating nations including Palau, Yap, and the Freely Associated States. In this case, we were able to include a different variety of our stakeholders, uh, teachers, school principals, administrators, um, curriculum uh, persons from the different uh, education district department. So it was really like a, a well-attended uh, um, conference. So whether it, when it, whether it comes down to um, helping our teachers get the tools they need to, to address all students, whether it comes down to the assessment, uh, we're, you know, um, ensure, we're, we're working hard to ensure that the system addresses all of our kids. The last day of training will take place Friday at the University of Guam. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Isa Baza.